Record. <coughs> hey everybody, Canon HT here, and uh, I'm finally posting another vlog. Um, I gotta be a little quieter because uh, NCS is, I think, is recording right now. Some kind of battle toast thing, or I don't know. Anyway, so I really haven't been in the vlogging mood, hence the absence of vlogs. Um, but now I have my camera back from letting NCS borrow it for packs. Um, also, check out my my sweet beard, which I'm slowly growing back. I don't know if it's as long as my previous vlogs. I cut it pretty short. And then also, I'll let you guys see uh, how long my ponytail is now. So, that's actually... I don't know how well that you could see that. So, anyway. Oh yeah, one more thing. If you ever hear like this, like a clinking noise, that's because on, on the end of the um, the wrist strap there's like a plasticky thing. And that, oops, sorry, <laughs> I'm showing you the ceiling. And that bumps into the side. Um, but anyway, I kind of decided I wanted to start doing something a little different on this channel. Um, I'll try to do some regular vlogs, but there was one thing in particular that I saw someone do that I really thought was quite clever. Um, and the guy's name is Alex Day. Um, he did uh, the Pokemon Love Song. Um, he also did like a Sonic song and I think something else. Um, but I think his Pokemon song is called Pokemon What Happened to You. If you search it on YouTube, you can find it. It's kind of a techno y song. Anyway, and uh, he, oh, well, <laughs> distraction. He um, decided to start reading. He actually read through the first Twilight book um, for the first time ever reading it. And like on camera, he read a chapter. A video and like let you guys give your input and whatever it's your first time reading so <clears throat> I decided I kind of want to do the same thing and I have actually four uh, series that um, I could read um, but before we do that I have to show you guys something really crazy um, right now I'm cooking a, uh, this hungry man and normally this uh, is chicken corn potatoes and a brownie, but now they have like this sauce in the uh, in the thing. Uh, you can't really read that. If I turn it, you'll be able to. I can't focus in. But anyway, it says a uh, uh, tangy buffalo style dipping sauce, and I'm kind of excited because what because when the brownie was in there, I always like scoop out the brownie, and eat the brownie first, and then put like ranch and barbecue sauce if I had those two, or like ketchup and mayo, dip my chicken strips in. So, thought about doing that. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and sit on the ground here right in front of the fucking door and uh, go through the series of books that I have. Now, I only have two of the first series that I haven't um, read. The first series of books I have never read. Um, so, I only know what I know about them because of my little sister. And that is the Twilight series. Um... I only have the first two books um, because I wanted to buy the pocket size instead of the giant soft cover and the hard covers. Um, if I decide to do this series, I'll like try to go out and get the next one. Um, if you guys want to see me do that, but I only have two of them, so and that I've never read, so that'll be interesting for you guys to see. The other one I have is everybody's favorite, J A R or J. R.R. Tolkien's Lord of the Rings, um, and I actually have all three of those, so I don't know if I can really pick these up very well. Oh, don't drop them. Don't drop them. There we go. So I have the three. I have all three of them. And this, I think, is the yeah 50th anniversary print. So, mm, I have that. Um, then, that's series two. Third series is Aragon. Uh, the first book in the Inheritance series. Um, I actually have read this. Um, I read this one about three times, and I read the second one about twice. Um, and I have the first, the first three. So this is the first one, um, and then this one here with the fiery bookmark. That's Eldest. That's the second one. And then the third one I have here. Um, I don't even know if, you, if my bookmark is still in here. Maybe. Yeah, I have a bookmark in here. There's my bookmark. And that's only... I'll, I'll stick it outside the book so you can see about how far I am. 
but the top is the beginning of the book, so that's about how far I am so far. Um, so if you guys decide you want me to do that series, um, it'll be kind of like new for me getting there. Anyway, so that's the third series. With the Lord of the Rings trilogy, I've seen the movies, but I haven't read all the books, like read through completely every single book, so um, I won't, I'll, I'll like pick up on all the little details that are different. Finally, the bo the books that started me wanting to do all these books, aside from Alex Day, um, now that the movies are finally done, um, is Harry Potter. Um, and I own the whole Harry Potter series. I'm not even going to try picking them up to show you. I'll just show you guys like this. So, you see on the top here, I have Sorcerer's Stone, and then I have Chamber of Secrets, Prisoner of Azkaban, Goblet of Fire, uh, this purple one, it, these are like, uh, cottony covers, that's, uh, Order of the Phoenix, and then the slightly thinner one, this is like a magenta cover, that's, uh, Half-Blood Prince, and then, finally, the, uh, <laughs> my, the cover my ex-girlfriend from high school actually, uh, doodled on. I don't know why that this character down here is either queefing or farting. I don't know if that's a girl or a guy. But anywhere. Okay, over here says poot. But anyway, um uh this is the Deathly Hollows. So I have side these. Um so I'm just gonna show you I put <laughs> I just have this oh there's a what the hell? Dude that's a friggin' spider. Look at this. Look at that. I'm gonna see if I can get it against the wall. Look at that. See it crawling? Ah ha ha, he's crawling up. Oh my god. There he goes. Oh, he's getting closer to the light. I'll probably kill him later. Not too worried now. Um, anyway. So I just put my, stack my books back up. Now that, uh, I've shown you guys all of them. Um, but the, uh, in my book stack. This, I should actually see if I can just fold that flap in because it's starting to get really annoying. Um, so, yeah, you can see here this says, says Brisinger. Or Br some people say Brisinger or Brisinger, and I say Brisinger. So, anyway, I'll just put that one there. I, like, start, that, like, starts holding up the flap. And then we have Eldest. And then we have Aragon. And then Lord of the Rings trilogy, and then finally disgrace the Lord of the Rings by putting Twilight on top. So anyway, so that that's well, it'll be sideways in the video, but there's a stack of books. Anyway, so um, so this is just something different I want to do on my channel, um, because uh, I know probably a lot of my viewers haven't read the Harry Potter series or are old enough that they would have read Lord of the Rings or um or wanna break the hype um for Twilight. Um but I've never read Twilight. I saw the first movie and it was alright, so I kinda know what I'm looking forward to, but um after that, no clue. Um but let me know uh in the comments below um which book you'd like me to start with. Um, and I'll go ahead and do one book for one series, um, well, the first book of each, of the series, and then I'll, you know, ask you guys if you want me to continue, if you want me to switch series, um, and then, of course, all the videos for that will be in their own playlist. Um, I will also be starting a new, um, numbering system, um, for these, uh, the numbering will be a little different, um, like the way the title looks will be a little different, but other than that, um, it'll be separate numbers um, to go in different playlists. Um, and I'll try to do some regular vlogs in between too. Um, that's about all I got. I uh, haven't decided if I'm going to put this on Polo yet, um, but for my Polo viewers, if you want to go over to Canon HT now that I'm active again, um, this will be the biggest thing that'll be going on in my channel right now. So. That's all I got for you guys. Um, hope you guys had a great uh, Labor Day weekend. I think it's Labor Day weekend. I'm not sure. Um, and 
yeah, that's about it. Um, last week was my birthday and I turned 22. Whoop do you fucking do? <laughs> so that wasn't meant to rhyme, by the way. Um, that's about it. So this will probably go up in between episodes of Glee. I'm watching Glee season two right now, and my phone just went off. Is everybody curious to see who tweeted? I'm pretty sure you all are. You're all dying to know. Ooh, four tweets. Okay. Tweet number one was someone retweeting my tweet to Splitable Infinitive, whose tweet was originally, my face at the end of L.A. Noir. it's kind of like a, ah, face, and I put, why you, I put, Splitable Infinitive, so you were all, why you know continue game, someone retweeted it, and then Split says she just trolled, and then she said, well, my last thought on L.A. Noir before I go to bed is, ain't nobody here but us chickens. And then finally, P call three hours of oh, fuck, 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 fuck. I gotta be careful when I'm throwing around challenge accepted. Okay. Apparently, there's something crazy going on with P call in front. Oh God, you're really, really close to my mouth. <laughs> Hello, you are my new orthodontist. Um, but my food is cooking. Oh, you can't see because it's not. Here, let me open the door. Oh my God. So, I'm making chicken fingers, because I'm hungry. I haven't eaten since, like, uh... Oh, I can't see the clock. I think I ate when I got... When I was driving up, I stopped at Fond du Lac. You got a cheese... No, I got a turkey burger from Hardee's. It was alright. I wish I hadn't had to pay, like, five bucks for the meal, but... Meh. It was okay. It needed more sauce. So, I, like, pretty much just dredged it in horseradish and ketchup. <laughs> so... Um, that's all I got, though. <clears throat> um, what am I up to? I'm up to 11 minutes. I'm almost tempted to throw this into Vegas and fast-forward it. Um, now that I know how to do that. Um, for the longest time, I didn't know how to speed up a clip in Vegas, but apparently you just have to hold down control and then, uh, left-click and, like, drag the clip <laughs> and it speeds up. So I might do that. That would be quite interesting. I'll do this at, like, times 1.3 speed. I don't know. So. <sighs> yep, that's about all I got for you guys. <clears throat> Welcome back to the vlogs. See you guys next time. Catch you later.